The final thing I learned from spending a year staring into this abyss is that we can win this fight. Gender ideology is insane, destructive, pervasive, ubiquitous, and beatable. You know, I get, sure. I get, um, I get asked this all the time. You know, is this a hill that I'm really going to, that I want to die on? Do you, do you want to die on this hill? And the answer is yes, I'll die on this hill. If there's any hill worth dying on, it's this one. The hill of objective truth. Yeah, I think that's pretty important. I'll die on that. But, uh, but though I'm willing to die on this hill, I, I don't plan on it. As General Patton said back in the days before the military cared about equity and tolerance more than killing bad guys, he said, uh, no bastard ever won a war by dying for his country. He won it by making some other poor dumb bastard die for his. Well, I would say the same metaphorically for this hill, this fight for truth, this struggle against gender lunacy. We can win because the other side can be crushed under the weight of simple questions. I saw this happen myself before my very eyes time and time again. The learned, the educated, the experts crumpled and collapsed and panicked in front of me, just this bumpkin wearing flannel with a, armed with a high school diploma, running out of the room. Is it because I'm brilliant? Well, th those are my preferred adjectives. That's how I identify myself. But um, no, I, I don't have to be brilliant, fortunately. All you need to do is just stand up and look this thing directly in the face. Serve it a healthy dose of skepticism. Force it to explain itself. The gender ideologues are weak and scared and vulnerable. They've perched themselves on a limb that isn't even connected to a tree. They're anchored in nothing. Their worldview is empty and frail and flimsy. We don't need to be armed with anything but a spine, enough to stand up against them straight, just stand up straight and ask questions. Questions that cannot be answered. Questions that, for that reason, aren't supposed to even be asked. But we must ask them. And if we do, we'll win. And we must win.